I think part of the the mystery and the excitement of betrayal is that because it goes backwards in time and usually the audience acquires more knowledge and information than the characters do so it's a sort of a progress into innocence which when you think that the play is about uh, a serious a, a love affair um, and adultery uh, that for the characters to proceed backwards towards innocence leaving the audience in knowledge is a really quite remarkable gesture because I think at the end of the day what is exquisite about the play is that it makes no judgment. It's not always easy, I tell you why, because we start with the end and the end it's the separation and it's quite heavy in a sense even though you know there's a kind of lightness refining a lover that you haven't seen for two years at the same time we're going lighter and lighter and usually in stories you start with a more lighter you know moments and then you end up with a, this tragic thing you know for people to understand what you've been through. It's not a lot of emotion worn on your sleeve, you know what I mean? It's like a lot of plays are. Like a lot of audiences want to see now, you know, they want to see someone cry their eyes out or, or I think it's much more interesting to see and much more moving to see someone struggle not to. I like risks and that's why I'm working uh, as an actress because uh, you face your, your fear and then you have to to transform it and make it as something more confident and that you know you can share with people. And she's very beautiful, and, I, and it made me nervous at first. Uh, but then the way that we both uh, dove in to act the work, acting, uh, that's very attractive to me. It's very, very attractive to me when someone kind of embraces the work so openly, and she does very openly. And uh, I was charmed. The only way to be in between those two men is to love them, you know, breaking and burning your heart off of you. And, and that's the only way to survive this kind of uh, situation, which is quite impossible. But I think it's the only way for her. You know, she can't, she hasn't choose to be with two men, yet she has chosen because her heart was saying that to her. And she didn't stop herself by any morality issue, you know, it's just, uh, she, it was the only way that she could survive. Most people agree it's one of the great plays of the modern theater. I mean, it's why it's being done again. And it could be done again in 20 years. This company was really picked because I thought there's something very raw and open about all of them. And they're very brave. And they're, they're actors who are not afraid of being exposed. And that seemed to be a very good place to approach a play that people may have erroneously thought was about closure. It's not. In fact, it's quite the opposite. It's about opening.